Hi everyone, it's Nerd Mom. Make sure my camera's not wobbling. I uh, decided to do a vlog for a little wrap-up post on the Blistem conference I attended last week. Um, it was in Nashville, Tennessee, and it was my first time in Nashville, along with my first time at Blistem, obviously. Um, and I had a lot of fun. I also managed to lose my voice some, or at least deepen it into that nice, sexy Kim Carnes version. I'm not quite sure how. I must be sick because uh, I can honestly say I was not screaming during the various concerts that we had, but it'll come back. It always does. So what did I think of Blistem? Well, first off, I loved going to Nashville because I got to see one of my good friends, Sammy Cohn. We roomed together at Savvy Blogging. We roomed together again, and uh, that's her home city, so it was awesome. Uh of course, I forgot stuff, so we had to make a quick shopping trip because that's just how I roll, apparently. Um, overall, Blistem seems to be one of those conferences that wasn't, for me, at least the sessions I sat in, so much about a technical sense. I didn't gain a lot of technical knowledge, but I gave a lot of inspirational knowledge. I uh, loved John A. Cuff's keynote. Um, it was really kind of convicting, and I'm not sure how fond I am of that idea. But um, you will be noticing some changes in my blogging due to that. Um, I, I think I'm going to be starting another blog, and yes, before you moan, another blog. But this one's going to be a little bit more focused and a little bit more uh, fun. Just fun, 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 fun for me. Um, he, he did a great job, including giving everyone the book, his new book, Quitter. And that was really awesome. And he's just, he's really kind of adorable and really hilarious. So... It was really enjoyable. I met lots of great people. I, I had a, a ball getting to know people that I've only ever seen on Twitter, who some of which I didn't even know were going to be there. It was really awesome to put some faces and some real-life personas with the Twitter personas because you never really know how much is bravado and how much is them. Um, I got to see some people I haven't seen in a while that I've seen at other conferences, and that was great. Uh, I loved Holly Heyman's uh, talk on uh, entrepreneurship and taking your next idea. I think it was called something about making your next idea, your idea the next Facebook. It was really great. And there was some, uh, some kind of checkpoints to go through to see if you're cut out for the business of any business, but kind of that business entrepreneurial life. And I, you know, I sat through some other really great um uh, talks that had some workshop portions with them. And one of the things that just, you know, I think I go to these conferences and I realize how much I'm not me on my blogs in some ways. Apparently, people think I'm funny and not funny looking. They actually seem to think I'm kind of funny. I had somebody who tell, told me that I need to kind of be the Christian blog ass or the the female John A. Cuff. I, I don't think I'm that funny. So we'll see how that works out. But there's definitely always been encouragement for me that for me to be that more sarcastic, sardonic person that I am in real life. Because in reality, I'm just not that positive. I just don't care that much. Um, it's kind of funny. But at the same time, I want everyone to like me. So that's kind of a big emotional takeaway that I took from Blistem of just, you know, people seem to like being around me in real life, so what's the deal? Maybe I should, I want to channel that to my blogs. Um, it was a big conference uh, with over, I'd say about 700, 750 people with some really awesome sponsors. I finally got to meet the infamous Christina Libby from Microsoft Windows. Um, we've been tweeting about it around each other for a while. and We have a lot of the same acquaintances and friends um, in the Twitterverse. So it was awesome to meet her and to learn more about some of the stuff that Windows and the OneNote's doing. Um I just I I come back both encouraged and overwhelmed and excited yet depressed if that makes sense. I I have lots of things I want to put into action, but I also came home to life and life's here and life's wonderful, but life's busy. So, um bear with me while you see me put together some of the stuff that I've been inspired to do from Blistem, uh, even though if it takes me a month or two to do it. And I'm just, I'm, I'm happy I went. I uh, really enjoyed myself and I'm going to miss all my Blistem friends. I hope to see you all at the next conference. 
and I will talk to you all later. Bye.